how did we make payments thousands of years ago when we lived in small villages and knew and trusted each other? We simply exchanged things. Over time, we started using money as an intermediate step, much as we still do with cash today. When money moved online, things got more complex. Banks and credit card systems need to keep detailed records of who owns what. For example, if I want to pay a Kona, I tell the bank to transfer the money into an account. This works because we trust the bank to keep accurate accounts and make sure Fabian and Akona can't cheat. If they have different banks or are in different countries, 30 euros. It can you see. The banks need to agree on the money being transferred. This is a complicated process, which is why banks charge a fee and transfers can take a long time. Bitcoin changes all this. How? It's one global online system that lets everyone access their accounts and transfer money anytime and anywhere. The result? Fabian can pay a corner without all the delays and fees. On essaye avec Bitcoin? Colombie. Just like it used to be before the world became big and complicated. Oh, in course. Merci. And what can people do with their Bitcoin? Everything they would do with normal money. Send it to friends and family, both local and abroad. Buy things online, get paid for their work, and so on.